But if you haven't done anything wrong, don't punish yourself. Hello, my name is Augustus, and welcome to my channel. I learn about social barriers and norms to help people become their true self in life. So if you like my videos, please hit subscribe and you'll see more of my videos. Nice, right? Today, I want to talk about the feeling of feeling, feeling like a loser. It's not something pleasant. It's not something that we want to talk about. Yeah, but it's real. It's there. It's feeling like we're just inferior as people. Somehow, because of something that we did, we're less of a person. And that we're not going to be socially accepted. We're going to be excluded because we're this loser person. And that's not true. I'm going to tell you the different factors I have. Oftentimes, I feel like we feel like losers because there's this narrative that you play inside your head. Because of something you did or something you have that's making you unacceptable. It can be like, oh, you're not tall enough. Or you don't have a girlfriend, boyfriend. Or you don't have your teeth are somewhere crooked. All these things is contributing to you as a person and making you less of a person. And are these things true? No. But somehow you have ingrained in yourself that this is the reason that you are. You need to change that perspective as much as people focus on it and want to laugh at you about something or hone in or make you feel inferior. It doesn't make that fact true. You are seeing some of the people with the biggest flaws and those flaws become their strengths. Like there are some people that are extremely short, like comedians, like Kevin Hart, and he used that to his advantage. There are things about you that you can change and things about you that you can't. But there are things that you can write narratives about yourself and believe about yourself that makes you not believe that you had to be somewhat inferior. Because it's simply not true. And how do you change this? You have to first change the way that you talk to yourself. If you start like hammering down on every small mistake that you do, like your like this nail that's being meant to hammer all the way down, then you're going to feel comfortable when you're punished. And what like why would someone be punished? It's because they had done something wrong. So if you haven't done anything wrong, don't punish yourself. So change the way you talk. Don't call yourself losers. Don't use language like, oh man, dude, that was such a, I'm, I'm such a uh, moron. Or I shouldn't have done that. Like cut out all the negative talks and all those under tones underneath and literally just stop it. If you're not, if you made a mistake, don't punish yourself. Don't punish yourself. Cut it out. Stop right there. That's it. Then you stop treating yourself like someone who has some, some, something wrong. You are literally going to shape the way that you view yourself. Cut out self pity. Don't go around and look at these uh, pictures, articles, memes, groups about ways for you to feel sorry about yourself. It's not going to change anything. And the more you dwell, dwell on it, the more it becomes part of you. So focus on different things that you want to become and change and work towards that. Don't make the part of you that's negative do the story of your life. You can change that story. You can be the person that came out of a bad environment, but then change themselves into become someone that has a much better life and that's much more successful socially. Feeling like someone inferior, this thought is literally all within how you see yourself. No one, like, no one can change that except you. And the thing is, if you want to change it, then it's changed. So all you have to do is examine yourself and changed the narrative that's within your mind. 
and you can start by a simple action today. Today, I want you to try to just go a single day without saying anything negative about yourself. Nothing, just try it. So stay strong, stay healthy, eat healthy if you can too, uh, because it just makes you your body feel better. And I will see you guys next week. Take care. And it will make you feel much better. I promise. <laughs>